Hello, uh, quick review of the self-sticking camo tape uh, that people use on their guns. Um, like this, this sort of roll here. Um, they come in packs of one, packs of two, packs of three, different colours. I mean, I've got sort of white and black snow type camo. Um, and I've got a really dark grey, almost black one there. You get green camo, blue camo, orange camo, basically any colour you like. They vary from about three quid up to... I think some of the more expensive ones are seven, eight quid. Um, and it's basically a tape. Um, I've just taken this one off this barrel. This is my hat and it had some camo tape on it. It's been on it for a while and it started to get frayed. So I've taken it off. Um, so you can see it's, it's, quite, it's quite stretchy material. And as I say, it sort of sticks to itself. It's sort of grooved. It's a bit like Velcro, but it hasn't got the hook and eye. Um, but it, it, it feels sticky, but there's no actual glue. I've taken this one off the barrel. There's no residue on the barrel. Um, I did give the barrel just a quick degrease and, and clean just because I'm putting the new one on. But it doesn't leave any sort of glue residue. Um, so people use it for two reasons, really. Obviously, if you're hunting, you're stalking, you're sitting in a hide, you, you might want to camouflage the end of your barrel. Some people wrap them around a scope. Some people wrap them around the whole gun, the action. Um to stop you know any sun glinting off them or any reflections so it, there is the camouflage purpose but the other purpose is um, I mean at my range we quite often leave our guns against the, the benches where we shoot and they're sort of metal framed so sometimes the end of your barrel can get scratched so we put the tape round to protect the, the end of the barrel so they don't get scratched so I've taken one off I'm now going to put a new one on so hopefully this will go on nice and easy, but you never know. So again, your, your first sort of wrapping, you want to get quite tight. So I'm pulling this quite tight. And then once you've got your first one on, then obviously you start to move it along, you're, you're overlapping it. And I sort of overlap it by about half. So every winding, you're going down about half the width of the tape, keeping it quite tight. And it's up to you. You, know, you might just want to do the end, the last couple of inches of your barrel. I'm going to go, you know, pretty much the full length of the barrel. And again, when you get to the end, you want to do a sort of double wrap. That'll do me, I think. So now I'll do a double wrap. And then I'll need to cut it. And then I'm going to stretch it and pull that bit round. And there you go. That is my barrel newly wrapped so it won't get scratched. You know, that took, I don't know, 30 seconds, a minute. It doesn't take too long. And uh, it will now protect my barrel from scratches. Or if I ever were to go hunting, I mean, I've not got any permissions, but if I ever did get any, you know, then I'm... I'm camoed up to the max on my barrel all right uh, i recommend it they're, they're quite cheap like i say but they're good quality products even the cheap ones seem to seem to be good quality um so yeah see you later